Right, so we're on Twitch right now looking at Michael Murray, the, uh, Harada and the whole team on their Tekken talk. This is just before Tekken 8 release, really. The Tekken World Tour Finals. It's developers, you know, these are the high-ups in Tekken. And they're all wearing the Reina jacket. So this is probably going to be about Reina. Don't spoil nothing, please. Online. No slash. No slash. Yeah. Sorry, I have slow slides off today. Is that better now? Too many. Too many. Like like twenty hundred pages. That's cool. Is that better? Something like that. Welcome to class. Better. Is that better for you? Look, can you look here? Okay, no problem. Uh, so many of you have already uh, seen some of this information, but uh, bear with us for the newcomer. Yeah, the arena jacket looks sick. Alright, let me not talk. Off, uh, explain a little bit about the online portion. Okay, yes, yes, I'm so happy. Uh, we're already sure that many of you have experienced this in the uh, demo that we released recently. Uh, but the Tekken Fight Lounge is quite an exciting place, uh, and we hope you'll check it out in the retail version as well. Okay. So, uh, some of you have probably seen this in the, in the CVT, but uh, this is an area where you can uh, look at items, various items, to customize your character uh, or your avatar or even your player profile. And you can uh, select from various ones or, and even try them, in, uh, try them on in the lobby. Okay, so practice. Can you play against your friends? Online practice. I heard online practice. I heard online practice. So this uh, Tekken Dojo online area wasn't available in the demo, but what it is is you can even online uh, go into this area and do various practice settings. Uh, hopefully in the future we'll be able to uh, update it so that you can practice with other people online, your friends, etc. That's what I'm talking about, my dog! Yo! That is sick. It's not decided when yet, but uh, yeah, so please wait for that. Yes. Next. Yes, online practice. This is what we needed from Tekken Tag 2 days. We needed that. Mm. えっと、あの、ティケンボールをやるにはこのビーチエリアに行ってください。で、ビーチエリアに行くと、あ、see、me so uh, everyone saw the very exciting beat the uh the Tekken ball matches we saw earlier. Uh, this is where you're actually going to be playing that online. So you can go into this area and you can uh, play with other people or you can watch other people playing their own matches. That's crazy, you could watch them as well. はい、えっと、バトルエリアの説明どうぞ。はい、えっと、バトルエリアですね、あの、CBT ではえっと、できなかった、ま、リーダーボードの確認ができるようになっていて、えっと、リーダーボードのランキングを確認したり、えっと、
ちょっと分かりにくかった、えー、グループマッチの、えー、とグループをあの光る枠で囲んで分かりやすくして、ね、筐体が並んでるところですかね、はい、あ次のページですかね、うん、ここはランクマッチやクイックマッチができる場所で、えー、CBT から変わったところはその筐体の開けるところにラインが引かれて、oh, so、分かりやすくこのグループで遊ぶよっていうのが、えー、視覚的に分かるように改善しています。So, although it hasn't changed a whole lot from CBT, the battle area,、um, obviously you can play ranked match,、uh, player match, etc. And then there was also a feature where you could play against other people in your own group of、uh, arcade cabinets.、Uh, one thing that has changed is this has been made to be a little bit more intuitive about who's in your actual group.、Uh, so, those are some changes to check out. And you don't have to directly go sit down in the group to play.、Uh, you can、uh, select from these various options、uh, anywhere in the lobby from the, the lobby menu. Okay. It's interesting. Hi, eh, to, ここがあの初めてえっとお伝えすることになってプレイヤーマッチですけども。Capacity of 16 plus one players allowed simultaneously. プレイヤーの人数が6人から17人。参加可能になっています16で、えー、なぜ17人かというと16人のプレイヤーと1人、まあ、観戦専用の人を用意してオンラインの対戦だったり、まあ、トーナメントプレイヤーの自身のトーナメントを運営しやすくするような会場です。16 is crazy! セブンは6人。So,、uh, the version that you guys have been playing has only been six players、uh, in this actual player match. But we've made a lot of changes for the retail version.、Uh, obviously, you can select from、uh, different settings, etc. But one of the bigger things is that the number has been increased from 6 to 17. And as you know, that's so that 16 players can play with one spectator、uh, slot, you know, if you want to stream your own tournament or whatever.、Uh, so that's what that's for. Hi. で、まあ、16人とか17人集まって遊ぶとすごい時間がかかると思ったので、まあ、複数台での同時進行にも対応してまして、まあ、同時進行しながらあと観戦もしつつ快適に遊べるように改善しましただから裏でねちゃんとやってる感じだよね、うんうん、And so obviously if you have a full lobby with 16 players actually playing it could take some time so obviously you can choose to do the run the matches simultaneously、uh, there's also spectator options etc That is crazy. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> okay,、uh, so next we want to go on、uh, to some of the offline content. Hmm. Hi, I'm going to go on to the demo band. I'm going to go on to the demo band. I'm going to go on to the demo band. I'm going to go on to the demo band. I'm going to go on to the demo band. もう格闘ゲーム市場では考えられないぐらいの、えー、ストーリーモード入ってます皆さん楽しみにしていてください。So、uh, I believe some of you might have played this in the demo. We have the first chapter available, so check it out if you haven't.、Uh, but obviously the level of、uh, you know, the, the quality, but also、uh, just the sheer volume as well is、uh, a lot more in the retail version, so we'll help you check that out. まあ,あのプレイするとわかると思いますけどめちゃめちゃ開発費ここにかかってます。So,、uh, you'll probably notice if you're playing, but、uh, a lot of our budget for this game was sunk into this particular mode, so we、uh, <laughs> hope you'll check it out. Yeah, yeah, this, 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 yeah you could tell, bro. This, <laughs> this, 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 this mode looks. You've never seen a story mode like this in any other Tekken. It's crazy. Hi, Arcade Quest is a player who 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 is a Bro, this is huge, bro. 16 player lobbies. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. So, some of you have maybe、uh, got a taste of this in the, the、uh, demo, but the Arcade Quest is a special mode for Tekken 8, which allows you to become a player in this tournament scene.、Uh, you follow your own story through this, and you have a mentor, Max, who kind of teaches you the ropes. So, As you're learning the game and leveling up as a player, 
You're also unlocking lots of different uh, uh, customization items for characters, avatars, also your player profiles. Uh, not only that, but if you uh, proceed through a certain area, you'll actually be able to fight against the ghost of me, Nakats, and Harada. Uh, if you beat us, maybe you'll get something special. So check it out. Crazy. This okay, quest thing is pretty good. So if I'm not talk, I don't want to talk over them, and I want to listen and then give my reactions afterwards. But yeah, I'm super excited. Sixty man lobbies is crazy. Oh my gosh. Are you dumb? Mandem lobbies are gonna be crazy. So the retail's been changed up a little bit for this mode. We all hope you uh, check out the, the changes and enjoy them. あ、これあの、よくビギナー向けのモードっていう風に紹介されたりしてるんですけど、実際にはストーリーがえ、ちゃんとね、あって、えっと、そういうナラティブになってのとあとさっき言ったカスタマイズデーションアイテムがいっ
drawn brand new artwork for Tekken 8 that you can set for these panels as well, uh, such as JB Style, Fuji Salasan, all the artists you love. はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。は
<laughs> offline originator. You lot know this already that I'm an offline originator. You know I'm going to be coming to these offline tournaments. You know what is going on. Let's go. No hiding, no, no hiding behind anime profiles. Real life stuff, man. Let's go. Offline Just events only. For the 2024 year. We're Let's go. Global leaderboard and a regional leaderboard. And I'm going to be explaining a little bit about that for you today. So, okay. The breakdown of the tour. So, as you'll see. Uh, These graphics look sick. In the number of masters uh, and the challengers and the uh, dojos. There's a lot going on. It will count towards your uh, actual scoreboard. How much views has this got? Fifteen thousand. Okay. Uh, another big change for this year is we only had one master, our uh, master plus for the twenty twenty three year. So but we'll be having two for Evo Japan and Evo. Uh, so the first one will be at Evo Japan, and I believe this is the first time we're announcing the details about Evo Japan. Uh, oh, oh, oh. To the Evo people. So that'll be taking place on April twenty seventh through the. I'm go. I'm going. I'm booking Japan. now. I'm booking now. I'm booking now. And uh, I believe registration opens up uh, pretty soon. So please, yeah, uh, yeah. stay tuned for that. Huh? Ah, uh, uh, we're going to be really uh, disappointed in you if we don't uh, have you all uh, registra uh, register for, for Japan. So like I said, I've been telling my friends, everyone, it's a perfect time to come out to Japan right now. Uh, the dates have changed a little bit uh, compared to the normal year. So it's going to be a, a little bit uh, warmer in Japan. Exchange rate for you guys is amazing. It sucks for me, but for you all, it's amazing. あとね、日本の放送これぜひぜひ見てる方もあのエボジャパンあのレジストレーション早めの方が実はいろいろいいんでえっとぜひぜひ早めにしてください。And we want more numbers than the other certain fighting games, so please register. <laughs> yeah. Remember offline events. So then also, you're going to be selecting your region. Uh, we're not going into details uh, yet today, unfortunately, about how many regions and what the regions are. But we'll be dividing it into certain regions, and you'll have uh, points that you can earn in your dojo in your respective region. So I'm going to be explaining oh. but the way that the points count towards the regional leaderboard and the global leaderboard a little bit different. So just keep mm -hmm. in mind that your region you'll have, and then you're, you'll be participating in the dojo to get points for that particular regional leaderboard. So this is really important. So we hope that you'll be supporting your local community by turning out to all the, the dojos that you can because that'll be affecting your regional uh, leaderboard. And you might actually get a chance to go to the finals based only on that alone. So this year, dojos are going to be a lot more impactful. So this is the breakdown between the two. So you're going to be having the global leaderboard where the highest ranking players uh, the number of which we'll be announcing at a later date. Okay. Uh, gets a ticket to the grand finals for 2024. And then you're going to have the regional finals in which uh, the people who are uh, very good at participating in their locals and uh, there are the top placing on the regional leaderboard will get a ticket to the global finals as well. え、今までね、結構世界中回ってこう特攻費ね、たくさんかかって、え、回れるスポンサーがついてプレイヤーしか結構ファイナル出れないみたいな状況もあったと思うんですけど、逆に今回このミックスなんで、え、リージョナル、
<laughs> wow, okay. Whoa. A lot of excitement here. <laughs> Chipotle is coming on board as the official sponsor. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> just uh, surprised at the level of excitement. He knows you Whoa. all love Chipotle, but this is a, a great reception. So obviously, you know, they've been supporting the fighting game scene for some time now. Uh, we're pa Crazy. Part partnering up with Chipotle for Tekken 8. And we're, we have a lot of exciting things in the pipe. So uh, please check out the site. I believe we're going to be having an original menu, and uh, you all get to decide that with us. I think nice. we're going to be having a selection of different menus that Parada himself is going to think of uh, with you guys. Chip isn't it called and Chipotle? At a later date uh, on the site, on uh, follow the X account of Tekken, you'll, you'll get more details. Uh, you'll be able to vote on your favorite menu, and you'll be able to then purchase that, min that, actually, that item in the app. Uh, and I believe that'll uh, do special things for you that we can talk about later. So please follow the account for more details at a later date. Ah, what, what about a Tekken Bowl, right? That kind of makes sense, right? Chipotle Tekken Bowl. I'm a personal fan of the barbacoa, but you know, we'll, we'll see what Harada comes up with. <laughs> it's just a name. Double beef, all right. <laughs> okay. Bro, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Listen, listen, listen. Don't tell me you can play the old games. Nakatsu just mentioning first time we're showing the logo for 30th anniversary. I kind of like it. You see the details in the wings representing some of the main characters, etc. Left one is representing Jin, obviously. Right is the devil Kazuya version of the wings, right? I think it's a pretty tight logo. But. It's already the 30th anniversary coming up this year because it's already 2024, right? If we start from the arcade version, which was released in 94, right? Uh, then the console... They're, go, they're telling there. us we can so play the arcade version. We have version. a lot of cool things to, uh, that are in the pipe works, but we have a lot of cool stuff to talk to you about regarding this today. So let's get started. First off, a big thank you to everyone... Bro, I can't uh, contain it, it man. With this. this was something that the fans did on their own. So all the artists came together and made this amazing piece of artwork. Uh, we're really uh, grateful for everyone who participated in this. So thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh. I think it's just beautiful, right? And uh, I can't wait to see what everyone does uh, with the new designs for, for Tekken 8. So looking forward to it. Then, OK, the next up. <laughs> So, I know everyone's what? asking uh, myself and Harada on Twitter about this, uh, but we'll be streaming the soundtracks uh, for past installments of the Tekken starting January 26th of this month. So, uh, yeah, all of your favorite streaming services, check it out. Uh, whichever ones you're, you're subscribed to, uh, you'll be able to listen to your favorite Tekken. On Spotify and Apple Music, you know? And, and Tekken 7. So the Tekken 7 soundtrack, I think, is a it's got a lot of bangers. I think uh, Tasty Steve would agree with me, right? <laughs> <laughs> and so oh, the, the base soundtrack for the initial game launch uh, was already on some of the subscription services. But if you notice, we have a Volume 2 coming, which includes many of the tracks from Season 2 and uh, onward. So like my favorite Far From Rom stage, I think that, that song is amazing. All those songs also will be added as well. So please check it out. And then also, <laughs> and uh, we'll, we'll have details later, but the QR code we showed in the previous slide goes to our Van Namco Sounds where you can uh, see which uh, songs are available in your region, et cetera. But Tekken 8 coming out this month, also gonna be included in the subscription streaming, uh, some uh, new favorites, hopefully. So please check that out when it comes out on the same date, January 26th. Crazy. Also, we have an amazing CD set Whoa. for Tekken 8 coming out with all these soundtracks. If you prefer to have actual uh, version, I actually have a sample with me today. Chucky, can you please bring that for me? Yeah. 
Yay! Open it up, Chucky. Open it up. So. てかこれ、俺も初めて見るんだけど。ちょっと見せて、見せて、なんか。これ、俺は初めて見るんだけど。そう、フランス戦、ファーストライブ。みたいな。はい。the CDs and all are pretty cool, right? but there are。wow。there's actually。looks good。ね。the stickers。there's some stickers, right? ああ、ステッカー。はい。that's pretty tight。pretty tight。but also。looks good。also there's a booklet included。ああ、booklet。inside。So the booklet is really cool because it has all the comments from the composers. This is crazy. Ajurika, all the people, some of my personal favorites, all wrote about what they were thinking when they designed these songs. So it's an amazing collection, and we hope you'll check it we, out. I, I need that. I need that. I need that. That looks sick. But, but how, how much is it? How much is it? How much is it? Uh, Regarding the price, we'll have details on the homepage later on. Oh, okay. So, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Proud of asking those hard questions. <laughs> thank you, Chucky. So, that's not all. Um, wow. For those of you who are in the uh, so Laced Records, we partnered with them in the past for other installments of Tech In. Uh, they'll be releasing a disc box for Tekken 8 as well. So it's going to be really cool. Razor board, slip case, uh, the sleeves, everything has been uh, a lot of cool artwork in this as well. So please check out their homepage for more details on this. So Rada is wondering, you guys are a pretty young crowd here. Uh, do you have actual equipment to listen to vinyl? Yeah. Uh, I do. Wow. Yeah, I think it's it's kind of a thing now, isn't it? Alright, let's move on. We got more stuff. Oh, what's this? So, uh, now that we're not wrapped up yet. Obviously, we have the most exciting part, the top eight coming up today, right? Tonight, yes, tonight. But after everything wraps up, I know I want to drink. Uh, I don't know about you guys. <laughs> There's going to be a Red Bull after party. You can see all the details here. The doors open at 9 p.m. This is crazy. Be sure, don't forget your ID because you need it to get in, yep. please. Mm. And we have these uh, cool little wristbands. Tokens, like wristbands. That lets you drink for free. Yeah, I'll just, oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll just catch a flight over there and go to the after party. Oh, no. Does anyone want some of these wristbands? <laughs> I think we got some staff that are gonna go around and pass them out. So, yeah. Uh, so the DJs are gonna be there as well. From uh, that you heard earlier today, gonna be pumping some amazing tunes. The three of us are gonna be there hanging out and drinking. So we hope to see you. And uh, everyone who wants the band go crazy, and the staff will get to you. Huh? Uh, please keep your hand up, for pe and the staff will get to you. Oh yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> I feel like a keep teacher. Hands up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all, almost oh. all people. Damn. Damn, damn, my brain. You know, Harada, I believe that there's a also a JB style t shirt yeah. that some people can get if you show up here. So, they're doing the doing stuff on the stage, boy. Yes, sir, this is the last one, right? I just updated one of my things. Hold on. Let me just see some. See if this works. Go ahead, go ahead. Okay. I know what you guys came to New Orleans to do, right? <laughs> I still don't really understand how New Orleans is, to be fair.
ないです。前のね、女性の方に。It's a busy guy, huh? All right. So anyone, it didn't get one hit. hit uh, I, I guess I'll. I think we have something else we'll, you guys are waiting for, so we should probably move on. Okay, let's see what's going on. Do we do it? Okay. Before that, <laughs> 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 we have some other cool stuff. So first off, um, I think maybe some of you have been out to our events and seen this really cool joystick. Uh, we partnered with Hori to make a special stick for Tekken 8. You know your boy King J is getting one. It's really easy. You can kind of uh, Shout out, Hori. click this button and the panel flips up so that you can do the maintenance on your buttons, etc. As you can see on the top, you can actually uh, swap out the artwork. And if you go I got to the Street Fighter 6 one to be fair. You're going to have character artwork for all 32 characters that you can print out and put in the panel. So I'm actually a pretty big fan of the stick. It's pretty tight. Uh, I hope you'll check it out. Uh, look at their homepage for the details. Oh, other some cool stuff. So, so I know Steve and Mike are pushing bro. this all weekend, but they are amazing figures. Uh, and these two in particular, uh, Harada and I did a video where we showed this yeah. off. If you go to yeah, these figures look sick. But the uh, printing, the, the technology that, that they have for the faces, uh, the actual the movement of the joints, the texture of their clothing and all that is super amazing. One of my favorite figures, and for this price point, I don't think you can beat it. Uh, please check it out when it's released. I know I'm going to love these. I'm personally, they're in my collection, so. So, a collaboration with Venom, uh, right? Uh, as you all know, I do Muay Thai. I actually use Venom gloves and shin guards, so I'm a big fan already. Uh, but we did some uh, collaboration merchandise with them. You can notice uh, the Jin inspired design on the left, uh, martial law inspired design on the right, uh, and then a pretty smooth t-shirt on, on the right that's more subdued. But uh, we got a lot of cool apparel uh, planned with them. Uh, not only this, but a lot of other things like rash guards and uh, shorts and things that you can actually use in the gym if you like. So uh, this is one I'm really excited about and I hope you'll check it out. And we're not finished yet. Whoa. Display. So. I know many people, mm. especially Mark Man, have been uh, complaining about the lack of merch, but uh, we're getting there. We're getting merch, Metal boy. Posters featuring Tekken artwork from uh, Tekken 8. It's going to look amazing, especially the one on the right, kind of the special artwork that we released. So these are going to be in po uh, metal poster format. Uh, they're launching in January, so pretty soon, right? Uh, I hope that you all check this out. Look at their homepage as well for more details. But uh, super sweet. I've seen some of the samples, as have Harada and Nakatsu. Nakatsu said he's going to put it up in his room. Edwin, so I don't know how many of you know Edwin, but they're I don't know what Edwin is. jeans maker in Japan. Uh, we've collaborated with them to make a Tekken inspired uh, jean jacket. It's pretty tight. You can see the intertwined fist that's inspired by the uh, Tekken World Tour trophies. But not only that, but some of the character artwork that inspired some of the patches that are on the back. So this also is a pretty sweet this is uh, jacket. Crazy, I think boy. be showing this off at a later date as well. There's a lot um, going on. We'll start pretty soon on the 26th, the same date as the, the game. And uh, you can look at the QR code to, to check out their site. But uh, this is also a really, really cool piece, uh, this helping us celebrate the 30th anniversary. So I hope you'll check it out. Not done yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, snap. More Vitrix. for you guys and a controller. So we're teaming up with Vitrix this time around. As you can see, uh, we've got the character-themed uh, joysticks, arcade sticks. Wow. You guys are excited, <laughs> huh? This <laughs> is sick. And in various different colors. We also have a, a pretty unique uh, pad, kind of that's designed to uh, look like the Rage Art uh, graphics. So all of these are going to be ah, coming these from look sick. But they're coming uh, late, though. Check out the individual regions to see when they launch, because I think the launch date is different for each. So look, uh, please, for your respective region uh, on their homepage. Pretty tight, though. I kind of like Scott the one. The gin one's pretty Yeah, I've got some too. good rest. I'm chilling. Just watching this. How are you doing? Okay, and yes. We're still not done. We have more stuff. Yes. So we've got a diorama, uh, especially for those of you in the EU region watching. This is on our B in the EU store, I believe. So we have the character diorama at the top right. We hmm. also have some a cool selection of different character artwork on T-shirts and hoodies. 
Uh, and then also, if you like a lot of lights, uh, this kind of light up uh, mouse pad we have, you see on the bottom right. So all of these merchandise can be uh, seen on the Beat Namco, the Bandai Namco Entertainment Europe website. So please check that out. Uh, a lot of cool merch coming. Uh, I think some of it's available from the 26th, so please check out the site for more details. Oh. Yeah, Uniqlo. Yeah, Uniqlo. So some Uniqlo. of you remember back in the day, we did some collaborations with Uniqlo in the past, but we're doing it again for Tekken 8. We teamed up with them for some really cool items. We They actually commissioned this special artwork uh, for from JB Style uh, to commemorate this collaboration. He's actually wearing one of the t-shirts that they have available. I wore this in the video that Nakatsu and, and Harada and I did as well. So some really sweet merchandise. Uh, let me talk a little bit about it. So as you can see, we're going to have a selection of different uh, actual merch that you can purchase at their stores. Not just in Japan, but this time they have many stores abroad as well. So uh, many people abroad will finally get a chance to get their hands on this. My personal favorite is the white uh, mm. Tekken 2 King shirt, which I wore in the videos. But you, all of them are quite unique. I really love the one that, that has all the, the logos from the series on the back. And then there's also the one with some of the characters. How often are you going to see some of these uh, more unique characters that we don't see a lot in the official artwork? Uh, all three of these are going to be available. Check it out. Not just that, but we have something more exciting to talk about for this collaboration. Hi, game and I will collab. Yeah, in so game collab. In game collaboration. Nakats kore kakoi yo ne. よかった。これ結構デザイナーがこだわって作ってくれたんで。キャラクターにはその白と黒のTシャツが切れて、アバターにはロゴが入ったTシャツが実装されます。So Nakatsu and his team of designers actually work closely with uh, Uniqlo to design these items and implement them in the game. Uh, you'll also have uh, uh, you'll be able to uh, select these for your characters, your in-game characters, but also there's a version to wear for the in-game avatar as well. So the black and white t-shirts for the character, we have a separate one for the avatar available. So those are going to be pretty cool. They'll be available mm. in the uh, online lobby. So as you can see from here, uh, not only are we going to have these items in the, on in lines, uh, the online store, but the online store itself, that, that store area we showed you, is going to be kind of taken over by Uniqlo during that time. And you'll see a lot of cool artwork and all well, the I was talking about everything. I mean, I'll talk. To kind of uh, commemorate this. So it's going to be very exciting uh, starting uh, around that date we mentioned. So please look forward to this. I want to say something. So okay. remember I told you about like time, time, like, you know, seasonal all, takeovers. Uh, not the, not the actual shirts, the in-game stuff, right? Yeah, in-game. In-game, not only. Not only. Not Yeah, so it'd be extremely exciting. I can't wait to see everyone online and see which shirts that they choose. Are we ready? Alright, I'm sure Eris' chat is getting antsy at the moment, so... Uh, <laughs> あの、じゃあちょっとその前振りした方がいいと思うから。えっと、オープニングムービー、いわゆるシネマティックなんですけど、オープニングムービー入ってましたね。で、デモ版に入ってたものとか、あの、デモ版のその、なんか、勝手に流れるやつとか、あとストーリーモードの終わりに流れてるやつ。
Okay, another trailer. Another trailer. Here. Another trailer. Okay. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Do I need to get the ultimate edition to get Kinjin? All right, so, uh, you know, I'm sure most of you have already pre ordered the ultimate version. Uh, am I right? <laughs> yep. But uh, for everyone who's new to the stream, Collector's like, Edition, mate. We just want to go through a little bit more of uh, what options you have if you haven't uh, pre ordered the game yet. So, Kotsugi Masai. Thank Masai you, dude. But I'm not getting the PC version on collectors. I'm getting a PS5, PS5 one. If you see the ultimate edition, we're going to be talking about the individual things that are included. Uh, so we'll be talking about it in more detail. I'm getting both. First off is the avatar costumes that are included with the, uh, the uh, ultimate edition. So these are one each for Kazumishima, Jin Kazama, and Jun Kazama. Not only do you change the look of your avatar, but as you Ooh. can see in the video, yeah. they have special emotes that allow them to do... Uh, certain actions, right? I think it's pretty tight. I actually asked Nakatsu for this. special emote And so Nakatsu was just mentioning that these emotes aren't tied to these character skins, so you can do your own avatar customization as, as long as you have this skin in your possession, you can choose to use electric emote for any customization that you want. Ultimate edition is the best way to get that. Then also, we have the uh, classic Tekken t-shirt collection, which is included with the Ultimate Edition as well. And what this is is various uh, t-shirts for uh, the avatars, but it's got a lot of art artwork that's uh, picked up from various things throughout the series. So not just Tekken 8 artwork, but character artwork going back all the way to Tekken 1. Some very classic designs. There's uh, a bunch of these, and you can equip them to your avatar uh, however you like. So very unique item, uh, one of my favorites. And then I know it's a little bit uh, difficult to understand uh, what's in it exactly, but uh, so we, these are the contents. So you have the standard edition, the deluxe edition, uh, ultimate edition. But there's also an ultimate pack. So for those of you who've already ordered or pre-ordered the uh, standard edition and were like, oh man, I kind of want the, the shirts or, or the content we just showed, you can actually purchase the ultimate pack separate, which gives you access to those items I just uh, talked about. But you don't, get the, you don't get the season pass. More importantly, more importantly, what? if you have the ultimate edition or the deluxe edition, uh, you'll have access to each of these characters that come out 72 hours ahead of their official release. ウルトラコンデル。and Nakatsu just catching up our Japanese viewers, so uh, just repeating what I said. So very important, I'm sure everyone here, that's uh, extremely important to you all as well. So I would personally recommend at least the Deluxe, uh, if not uh, Ultimate. But that said, um, we know people want a variety of different options. So if you want to purchase some of the content that's available in the Deluxe Edition, uh, and you've already uh, reserved the Standard Edition, you can also purchase that separately. And you can see that in in also includes the character one year pass, that which will also give you access 72 hours ahead of time. I and don't know if that's... Get access to the skins that you saw in the trail that we 25 hours is sick, but so 72 hours is wild. Pick, pick and choose uh, which elements you want if you haven't already uh, ordered the, the uh, ultimate or the deluxe edition if you've only ordered the standard. 
So uh, choose the one you want. I personally would recommend the ultimate because you get everything at the start. Again, so the date, 26, less than two weeks away. And uh, we hope that you'll, you'll look into these versions. And uh, we'll, we'll all be online in the lobbies uh, sporting all this cool ultimate uh, pack edition uh, content. So I hope you'll check it out. I'm going to be rocking that uh, electric wind god fist. So mm. uh, I think we're time. It's time, right? Yeah. Can we get the camera? Okay. Yeah. 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 So, in the case of the Tekken series, I'm going to do no title anymore. This is crazy news, though. え、今回デモ版見た人で、えっと、最初にね、こう、インストールして勝手にタイトルロゴから流れるムービーとか、あと、ストーリーモードのえっと、チャプターが終わった後に流れてるムービー、あれをね、オープニングムービーだと思って
Jeez. Yoshi, we see Yoshi in the trailer now. Hey. Nah. <laughs> I think June is a memory, though. I just. Okay. Yeah. 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 End it like that with the Tekken thing. Oh. Uh oh. That's where Devil Jin comes into it. Tekken 8. Yeah. 10 out of 10. See that intro there? 10 out of 10. See that? <gasps> I told you. Eddie, I told you. I told you. I told. Bro, what did I tell you? What did I tell you? I said they're going to show something. Oh my gosh. I told man. I told man. I told man. I told man. Oh my. I told man. I told man. I told man. I told man. What did I. What? I just said it on my tweet. I just said it on the Twitter. I just. I just said it. I just said it on Twitter. I just said it on Twitter. Eddie would be first. I wasn't even lying to you, lot. And there's another trailer. Nah, that's it. All right, guys and girls. That is crazy. There's so much going on. We're going to put this up on the YouTube. Shout out to everyone on Twitch. You know what it is already. We're going to watch the Tekken World Tour Finals. But I don't really want to watch the Tekken World Tour Finals on Tekken 7. I need to unpack some of this stuff and react to it again. So there's going to be stuff on YouTube. We're going to react to it in the next 32 minutes. There's 32 minutes here, so we've got time. Crazy scenes. Let's get into it. <laughs> 